What is up ladies and gentlemen, it's Matt from School Busters here and today we're on Gran Turismo 7. Now the update has just dropped, the update 1.12, I'll show you in a minute. But I'm just showing you that the, not the exploit, but the the 2.4 million per hour still works. I did get a clean race and 825,000 credits. Uh, on uh, Tokyo Express. So there you go, the money's still there, you can still t do the 12 laps and you can still use the SRT Tomahawk VGT. And just to prove it to you, there's update 1.112, okay? So what you do is you head over to manual adjustment. You want to start from 7th gear as you can see in the video right now, but I'm going to speed it up. Start from 7th gear, work your way down to 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And then you've got to keep going back and forth with the third, second and first gear. Once you keep doing that and get it down to 40, uh, 41, 43 and 45, you want to do your power restrictor and then you want to do your ECU adjustments. And then what you should do, you should press... You want to press triangle, back out, back into it and then it should readjust right here. Once it readjusts, you can go and use the car, okay? Hey guys, it's Neil from Skullbusters. And in this video, I'm going to show you the best money farming uh, method in the game right now. Um, so you can earn just under 2.5 mil in an hour. So that's 825k in 20 minutes. So the first thing you need to do is go to Brand Central, uh, head over to America. And then you, what you want to do is go to Dodge and you want to buy, go to showroom and then you want to buy is the Tomahawk and it is this one in particular. Um, so yeah, it's a million credits, a lot of money, um, but for this method, um, you'll get that money back within two um, races, let's say, easily. Um, so yeah, it's worth it. Worth investing um, to get this best m m farm money farming uh, method. So it's worth investing. So purchase the car, pick any colour you want, um, and then what we need to do is just give it a, a few a few little tweaks um, so that we can tune it, fine tune the car to bring that PP under uh, the battery that we need. So you need to buy. Uh, the power restrictor I bought the ballast I, we didn't end up using that but I just bought it just in case the next thing to buy if you come over to racing come to the bottom um, fully customizable racing transmission um, make sure you've got the racing hard um, I bought the others and also the intermediates and the wets um, I bought all the tyres basically and just had the option of having them um, but you, for this, you just need racing hard. Um, just buy the other things, like I said. And then what you want to do is come on to uh, World Circuits. Then on Asia Oceana, come over to Tokyo Expressway. And the race, what we're going to do is the one at the end, which is World Touring Car 600. Um, as you can see, 550 credits for the win. For a clean win it's 825k so put your racing uh, hard tires on make sure that it's them tires in particular and then what you want to do is, uh, is pause this really and copy my setup so the only things that I changed leave all these uh, set as as what it was when you buy the car you don't need to alter all this bit the only thing that you really need to alter is the transmission so um, what you need to do is drop that to 580 as you can see on mine and then go on to manual adjustments now forget the 7th, 6th uh, and the 5th what you need to alter is the 4th, the 3rd and the 2nd and the 1st alter all them gears all you're doing is just bunching the gear ratios up um, and, and all it is is just restricting the engine basically um, and it's just making the gearbox super 
uh, quick going through through the first four gears. Once it's in the fourth gear, then it just copes. So then the next thing you need to do is the power uh, restrictor. Put that on seventy. Output adjustment on seventy two. So on on seventy as well. Sorry, not two. Um, you don't really need to alter anything else other than that. Um, but if you copy this exactly how I have got it, press on triangle to remeasure and recalculate the car. Back it out if it doesn't appear there, and then go back into the race, and then that should recalibrate fuel. So the one thing when we go into the race is you want to um, change uh, the fuel mapping onto six. That means you'll get loads of uh, laps of fuel um, without pitting. The other thing you'd put on is the traction. I put mine on five, just gives you more grip around the corners and around the bends. Um, so yeah, you just need to do 12 laps of this. Don't wait in the cars. Um, the first thing you will do is the first couple of laps because the, cap, the track is absolutely wet and you're on hard tyres, you're not on wets. So you've got to really tiptoe round the track. Try not to smash into the barriers because you'll get penalised. Um, but don't worry, you'll lap all the cars by three laps anyway so just be careful though just like I say just really tiptoe be super cautious um, the first two laps after that there's, there's loads of grip because um, obviously the tracks just drying out uh, naturally um, but yeah you, you've just got to really tiptoe around this first lap uh, the second one's not as bad but the first one is the most delicate so I'm just lightly feathering the accelerator and just letting it roll uh, wait for the straights and just put a bit of gas into it. Try and watch the back end trying to step out. Uh, it's just trying to snake because of obviously the power and the torque. Uh, but you just need to control it so you can see there. It's trying to step out. Um, lap wise, um, the first couple of laps, you'll probably hit around, the first lap will be about 2 minutes 10. Um, after that, you'll probably get a 1 minute 40. Um, and then it's in the 30s, 1 minute 30s, 1 minute 20s. The fast I, the fastest lap I got around, I think it was about 1 minute 22s. Um, I've done this in 19 minutes, this whole race. Um, so like I say, it is doable under 20 minutes. So you just need to do three of these uh, for the hour. And what it'll give you is um, 2.4. Mill, so it's just under 2.5 mil. Um, so yeah, that's it's a really it's the MVP basically of money grinding. Um, hopefully they won't patch this. Um, fingers crossed they don't. But like I say, it's it's really fast. We we have got other money farming videos on our channel. Um, we're always looking for different ways of trying to get that best grind um, money grind and find the the best method because obviously the cars are super expensive and uh, yeah it's just crazy so yeah you can see the first the first one I've done it in 22 minutes and then yeah, as you can see clean race bonus so that's straight into the bank so that's one race down I got the uh, one star roulette ticket and guess what you get for that? 5,000 credits. That's my luck. So, yeah, that was that first race. Uh, the second one, I won't play all the race because it's not worth you sitting here watching it. I'm just putting it in for the sake of showing you my totals. Um, so the second race that I've done, I've done it in two, uh, 20 minutes. Um, again, clean race bonus. So that's 40 minutes done, two races down, and then on to the third and the final one for the hour. And you'll see I did get it under the 20 minute mark. And so everyone that I'm doing now is right, it's quite under 20 minutes easy, like I say. So I hope this video helps. If it does, don't forget to subscribe. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.